Are you sure I couldn't have root canal surgery instead? Just tell the truth and don't sweat it. That's what you said to me last week when I was on the hot seat. Yeah, well, things are a little different this week. It's my turn. You told me about it. It's okay. The whole point of Narconaut is having a place where you can just be yourself. I know. All right. Okay. I got it. Okay, people. <laughs> Terry? You can do it. We're talking to friends. Okay. Well, my name's Terry, and um, I'm a recovering drug abuser. I guess that gives us all here something in common. Uh, I'd like to say that I've been clean for a year, but I'm supposed to be honest. Uh, I was clean for eight months, and then I had this brain-dead episode during the summer. But I've been clean again since September 3rd. Thanks. So far, so good. I'm also HIV positive. A little advice. <clears throat> Sharing needles. What a dope, huh? I guess I should have just said no. Too bad I didn't think of it at the time. Hey. I've been looking for you all morning. What's up? Look, I kind of got a favor to ask. Um, some friends of mine are doing this AIDS awareness thing tonight, and they were wondering if you could give a talk. What do you mean? What, do they know? Well, yeah, I told them, and they thought it'd be really great if you could... Whoa, whoa, whoa. You told them? Yeah, sure. How many other people have you told? Well, nobody, but I didn't think it was any big secret, so... Oh, no. But you told the group. Because that was Narcotics Anonymous. What we say in that room is supposed to stay private. Why do you think I transferred from my last school? Once everybody found out that I was positive, they stopped treating me like a person. N now I'm the guy walking around with AIDS. <laughs> Going, period. You're not changing schools again. What, you got a better idea? Oh, yeah, today was such a hoot. Of course, you saw that for yourself. I'm really sorry. I, I know that's a pathetically useless thing to say. Yeah, well, it's a little late for that. It's a little late for a lot of things. I just didn't think. No, you didn't. When you first told me, I was blown away by how upfront you were. And you're so totally cool with the group. What, you mean the bullshit? Yeah, well, I'm pretty good at that. You have to be. Otherwise, there you are, facing reality. I guess this is a new experience for you, huh? I mean, this is probably the first time you've ever met someone who's actually going to die. I don't mean one day or 60 years from now. I'm gonna die. I'll be lucky if I see my 20s. I don't know that. You don't know what you're talking about. You don't have any idea what it's like to be me. Okay, so talk to me. Tell me what I need to know so I can begin to understand. Let's take a walk. It was really wild the day that I found out. I went over to the doctor's office and he came in and he said, your tests are in and you're positive. And for this crazy second, I, I actually thought, thank God, it's positive. You know, that, that, means, that means good. And then I realized, wait a minute, positive means bad. Positive is, is very, very negative. Doesn't get much more negative than this. 
You were right when you said I didn't have any idea. But at least I know more than I did this morning. You could come to that meeting tonight. What for? So I can relive all those wonderful moments I had at school today? You're the one complaining that no one understands. So make them understand. Speeches and pamphlets and free condoms don't work. Kids are still getting AIDS. They're still dying because they think they're too cool or too smart or too lucky to get sick. So what am I supposed to do about it? Tell them how it really is. Oh, great. The, the heroic victim. Look, it's HIV positive man here to educate us all. No thanks. So don't do it for them. Do it for yourself. If you tell them the way things really are, then maybe they can start seeing you as a person and forget all the other stuff. Why is this so important to you? Because I care. Karen, I just want a chance to live a halfway normal life. Is that too much to ask? <laughs>